Hello and welcome to those endless mysteries. Today's sighting story comes out of California from the mid 1980s. The witness stated that him and his brother had gone on a backpacking trip. He says that they were hiking the High Sierra Trail. Now this trail runs from Bear Paw Meadows up and over the summit down into the Cran River Valley. Stating that they had made a long hike on the third day into their trip. He says they did around 18 miles this day, with the both of them being exhausted once they came upon a small lake called Moraine Lake. So with them being nice and tired, they decided to make camp at the lake. With this lake sitting high above the valley, he also said that they hadn't seen any other hikers this day. Now, as they were sitting around camp, stating that it was around dusk, when all of a sudden they heard a piercing and unearthly screaming howl, saying that this howl was of immense volume, even though it seemed to be emitting from a far distance from them. It was carrying quite clearly through the hills and peaks, the witness said. He also said that you could tell that it came from a large animal, and that this animal had a huge lung capacity. With the witness also stating that there was no way that you could confuse this howl with a human, a bear, or any other animal sounds that he has ever heard. The witness said that this howl only happened once, with it telling off and not coming to a sudden stop, stating again that it wasn't a human for sure. He also reflected that the howl seemed to be more sad than fierce or threatening, he wrote in his report. Saying that his brother called out, Did you hear that? With the witness replying, I sure did. Then his brother asked, what do you think it was? Again, the witness replied, I have no idea. With the both of them being on edge now, while being very tired as well, they decided to turn in and take their chances with whatever was out there. Now the witness says as they got back from their trip, that him and his brother stopped by a local diner to grab some real food. So as they were enjoying their meal, the witness noticed a newspaper. As he started reading, he noticed that it had a story about a Bigfoot sighting in it. The story was about three men being frightened while working on a footbridge in the Golden Trout Wilderness Area, which is in the area of Kern River. As the men were working for the U.S. Forest Service. Now in the paper it talked about how the men were severely frightened at dusk by what they described as a nine foot tall hairy beast coming down a hillside at them screaming very loudly. It was a classic Bigfoot sighting the witness said with the men firing a shot off over the creature's head with the three men being so upset that they packed up and made their way back to the ranger station, where they did file a report about what they saw at the bridge, where the ranger scuffed at the men, saying that they must have seen a bear or cougar, with the three men telling the ranger that they know what a bear and cougar looks and sounds like, with this creature being very different. Way different, the men told him. Kind of sounds like they might be getting a little upset with this ranger. With the coming of the next morning, the ranger accompanied the three men back to the bridge, where the three men and the ranger saw some large footprints and some gravel, but nothing that could have been cast. The witness says that the date of these three men sighting was the same date that him and his brother had heard the howling scream. So he's sure that they heard the same creature that the three men saw that day. Now that was a cool story with how the witness found something that verified what he had experienced. 
with both of the stories backing one another up. So till next time, have a great day and don't forget to subscribe or follow depending on which platform you're on. And hit that notification button so you can keep up with all of our latest videos. And thanks for watching those endless mysteries.